So hey guys, um, today's a new video, and as you can see, it's a Jiraiya event, um, also with Conan, but honestly, I'm mostly going to be concentrating on Jiraiya, because that's the one I plan on, um, not exactly maxing out, but really working on during this event. Uh, I already do have Gold Jiraiya, but a lot of his items are up for grabs right now, and you can easily get all of his items, and all of, nearly all of Conan's items, for... Um, 20k gold consumption as you can see i'm down to 4k so i've consumed quite a bit um but yeah from what i've been able to refine because um i am rather short on supplies uh for example this one the fukusaku and shima tier 4 it's very good at level 115 it gives 66k ninjutsu attack uh 96k ninjutsu defense it increases an extra 38k dodge to um jiraiya and 62k HP, and also does a skill called Sage Art Geomon or Genmon, whatever. Um, it does that skill, and that skill is really unique because it's a secondary attack, but what it also does, it gives a uh, Jiraiya um, one Shadow Clone or two Shadow Clones, and it will keep on doing it. Uh, it'll keep on releasing Shadow Clones until Jiraiya has two Shadow Clones. And those Shadow Clones obviously give him 70, I mean, 35% uh, uh, Ninjutsu attack bonus. So, I mean, he becomes ultra powerful. Now, I haven't been able to refine the other items. Uh, only the Fukusaku and Shima. Um, the next one I'm going to be trying to refine to see for is actually the Lion White Hair. Because that one also has a new skill for it. So, I mean, uh, yeah, that's the next one I'm going to try to refine to, um, to tier 4. But it does cost uh, 55 uh, Will of Fire. I only have 22. So right now I've been um, more than likely going to be kind of a bit of a dick when it comes to the to the mines. Because I want um, Will of Fires basically so I can refine all of his items. Uh, but yeah, it's a really good event in my opinion at the very least. Um, now the recharge is not very good. Honestly, um, if you're looking to get any Will of Fire, you're actually going to have to drop a lot of cash. As you can see here, it's only at up until like 10, 10k gold consum gold bot that you can actually get any sort of Will of Fire. And even then, um, it's only 50 and 100 Akatsuki. So honestly, I wouldn't recommend recharging too much during this event unless you're going to go for Conan. Um, now, Conan, I'm not really sure about her. Uh, I can't say she's a bad card, but I can't say she's a good card either. She does have a few items uh, for, I believe, so, I mean, either way, she should still be good. Now, um, they both have secondary passives. Uh, Jiraiya, the only way that you can get his is through buying 500 gold each day um, for the duration of this event, which I am going to be doing. And Conan, you actually have to recharge um, 5,000 gold to get her secondary passive. So, I mean, it's going to be it's gonna be quite pricey for both of them. Um, honestly, I'm only going to get Jiraiya's secondary passive. Uh, I'm not going to get Conan's. Um, Jiraiya, I already have him at gold, so that's nice. Um, so yeah, uh, he has five items. Uh, he has his weapon being the Toad, the Mount Mai Boko Scroll. Uh, his, I'm going to show you all his gear I have right here. So as you can see, um, his weapon being the Mount Mai Boko Scroll, tier four, well, at tier four. Um, I actually have this weapon at tier 4 at level 115, as you can see here. I have it on Naruto. It's an item for Naruto and Jiraiya. What it does, it releases a skill, um, which I think it's called Chakra Sense. Um, it decreases your enemy's dodge for one round. Um, it gives uh, 59k ninjutsu attack and 55k hits. And if you equip it to Naruto or Jiraiya, it will give an extra 59k ninjutsu attack, 40k HP, and 75 k 75 chakra recovery um it's a really good item and uh jiraiya is able to use it so that's very good another item is the as i mentioned before uh fukusaku and shima tier 4 um as you can see it's level 115 at level 115 it gives you 66k ninjutsu attack uh 96k ninjutsu defense and if you equip it to jiraiya it will give them an extra 38k dodge 62k hp and then the skill, I think I already explained about it. Um, it releases a secondary attack, and that secondary attack also gives um, Jiraiya two Shadow Clones. Uh, one Shadow Clone at the very least, and we'll keep on releasing until you can get that second Shadow Clone. It's activated by the unique skill, so you're going to have to release your unique skill. 
Now, the oil headband, um, it's not exactly uh, bad. It's not exactly good. It's just kind of there. Uh, this one at tier 4 does come with a, with a ninjutsu attack or a skill. But I don't know what it is yet. The Geta, um, same thing. Uh, no, no skill, just bonuses. I'm actually going to go over here. Uh, so as you can see, yeah, he has uh, five bonuses, bonus items. Uh, Shima uh, and Fukusaku, the oil headband, uh, lion, uh, lion white hair. The Mount My Vocal Scroll and the Geta. Um, at tier 4, they actually give him quite a few bonuses, as you saw already for, um, for, uh, for the weapon, the necklace, which is Shima and Fukusaku. And, uh, yeah, those two, they give him a lot. So, as you can see here, uh, for the Geta, if you equip it to Jiraiya, it gives him an extra 32k ninjutsu defense and 89k HP if it's tier 4. The oil headband, if it's tier 4, it will give him an extra 38k ninjutsu attack and 62k HP. And um, the lion white hair, if it's tier 4, it will give him an extra 67k HP, 58k ninjutsu attack, 135 tenacity, and uh, the skill called Needle Jinzo. I don't know what the Needle Jinzo does yet, but it's actually rather good in my opinion. Um, Jiraiya may just make my team now for the um, Ninja War, at the very least temporarily. Um... I mean, should I get Hashirama or Tobirama, uh, it will probably replace Jiraiya. But um, yeah, as you can see here, I'm going to go over here. Oh, I've also actually equipped his uh, level 105 passive, which is Earth Release Swamp of the Underworld. As you can see, um, reduces ninjutsu defense to all enemies after skill is released with chance, chance to twine for two rounds. After equipped, increase um, HP 7,900 plus 1,020 per level. Um, Ninjutsu attack 1,900 plus 120 per level. Ninjutsu defense 10,900 plus 520 per level. As you can see at level 75, obviously I don't have it as high as it can go because I don't have enough scrolls. But at level 75, it gives them 84k HP, 49k Ninjutsu defense, 10k Ninjutsu attack, 18k decrease on the Ninjutsu defense decreased. So, I mean, it does fairly well. Um... I've been uh, tr checking it out to see if it interferes with um, Itachi's uh, seal, seal, um, seal lock. Um, if I equip his other skill, which is called a uh, uh, Sage Art uh, or Toad Art, yeah, okay, it's a Demonic Illusion Toad Confrontation Chant. If I equip that one to Jiraiya, um, Jiraiya will mess up um, Itachi's uh, seal combination. But um, I'm hoping it doesn't come to that. Maybe when I combine them both, both Jiraiya's and uh, both the Earth Release Swamp of the Underworld and the other one, the Demonic Illusion. Hopefully, it will it won't, you know, constantly, uh, constantly counter uh, or disrupt uh, Itachi's seal seal lock. But this also this skill also has a chance to twine, and as you can see, he dealt one million on the critical, and as you can see also, he now has a Shadow Clone. Um, in the next couple of turns, he's going to release another Shadow Clone more than likely. Or maybe he's not. Uh, but yeah, I do know that he keeps on releasing Shadow Clones. Uh, those Twine things is exactly what uh, Madara Uchiha can do. Only difference is that Madara can do, does it um, more than a little constantly. He does it a lot. I think he does seal the whole team. Uh, whereas Shiraya doesn't seal the whole team. Uh, you can probably hear my brother here uh, snoring in the background, and I'm sorry for that. But yeah, as you can see, he's slowly dealing more damage. And he got that second Shadow Clone. So like I said, they still until, stay until the end of the round, but he will keep on getting Shadow Clones until he gets his uh, two Shadow Clones. Um, the thing is, is that I'm not quite sure what the Needle Jinzo does. It may add in another Shadow Clone and another skill, but I'm not quite sure what it does yet. So I'm probably going to be making a video about that later. Um, for those of you wondering, this is actually the skill that comes with Shinobi World War Jiraiya, which is this skin right here. Um, it does a burn damage, which does quite a bit of damage, as you can see. And uh, yeah, 800 damage each time, uh, 800k damage. Obviously, it's being argumented by the Shadow Clone. But quite honestly, I'm not putting as much ninjutsu attack as I could on Jiraiya right now. This is just him with some of his items and uh, only like maybe one of his items at tier 4, as you can see. It's only Fukusaku and Shima. Um, I could obviously put the tier 4 um, my, my Boko Scroll and like some other items to get him to 
you know, to boost up his ninjutsu attack. But, and that's actually what we're going to do. We're going to try to see it. No, we're going to try to see how far we can get for Jiraiya when it comes to ninjutsu attack. So I'm going to equip that. going to equip that. And uh, that. I'm going to take that away from Sasuke. And uh, equip that to Jiraiya. Um, obviously we're keeping his items on. Um, I'm fairly sure he would get more ninjutsu attack once his items are at tier 4. But at the moment, all I can get him to is a measly 400k ninjutsu attack with his items. I'm fairly sure I can get him higher if I go ahead and, uh, change these. Gonna take away these from, um, Sasuke. Gonna take away that. Gonna equip that. And that's and yeah he gets to 600k ninjutsu attack obviously he doesn't have a lot like my oh wait i forgot the geta still either way um he doesn't have a lot of ninjutsu attack but he does have a decent amount uh right now so it's let's see 668k ninjutsu attack 681k ninjutsu attack not a lot um not as much as naruto or sasuke which i can get up to 800 respectively um but yeah, it's a decent it's a decent amount of damage as you can see here. Like I said, it gets boosted by the shadow clones, and the shadow clones keep on releasing until you get your limit of two shadow clones. So it's very good in my opinion. Also, does twine um that actually uh, blocks your passive and your active, I do believe. So that's very good, and your unique skill. So yeah, as you can see, he's dealing a lot more damage. Uh, I think he just dealt a ten million critical, um, and his. Burning damage is dealing a lot too, so that's very good. And also, um, with um, with Orochimaru, he can double his damage once again. Uh, maybe he gets a red curse seal. So as you can see, Jiraiya just annihilated this with very minimal help from uh, actually uh, from Itachi. So I'm gonna be working on refining his items, but at the moment, unfortunately, I just don't have enough of the um enough uh dang it i was trying to find uh one that i would be able to easily tell how much damage i'm dealing so yeah it's 20 and that's 3.2 million on the critical so 16 6 point 1.6 mil and then 2 million on the second on the secondary attack so that's what 3 million worth of damage um and then he just got a shadow clone, so that was 2.4 million worth of damage. And yeah, he just, he, yeah, like I said, the shadow clone gives him 35% ninjutsu attack. And he keeps on releasing his shadow clone until he can get that second shadow clone. Um, so at the very minimum, he will always get a good 70% bonus, 75% uh, bonus on ninjutsu attack. Um, I think he may get more shadow clones uh, with a G with a needle one, but I'm not quite sure. Now the reason I'm I'm using the twine one, uh, the the twine skill, the earth release skill, is because um, the other skill interrupted Itachi's um, stun lock, and that's very bad, especially when you take into consideration um, if you fight in the ninja war. So that could be that could have some very devastating effects. Uh, so if I do end up using Jiraiya as in the Ninja War, I may actually just, uh, you know, uh, stick with uh, Jiraiya staying with only, uh, what do you call it? Uh, stick with Jiraiya staying only with the Earth Release Swamp of the Underworld um, because it does twine um, and it doesn't interrupt stuns. So that's good. Um, so how much, uh, how much, what would be the price for Jiraiya? Um, it's not so much of you trying to get Jiraiya because it's actually rather easy, in my opinion, at the very least. Uh, you just buy some, uh, you know, just get some stuff. The real problem being is that you have to, you have to cultivate, uh, you have to grind out Shima and Fukusaku, uh, to train up Jiraiya. And then uh, you actually need eight Jiraiya cards. So you're going to get some fragments from recharging. Uh, quite a few of your fragments are actually going to be just uh, in the form of recharge, honestly. Uh, you can do a gold 10 draw for one Jiraiya. I'm not quite sure whether or not it's for all of the, you know, for everything. You know, you get all of the gold 10 draw and you're fine. Uh, but um, for what I mean by that, if it's for every day, the gold 10 draw. But at the same time, uh, I would be weary of it because it may not be like that. 
it may be just one day and uh, you can try the second day and you won't get anything from the gold tundra except for what you were intending to get basically and it kind of sucks too because uh, Tsunade is not uh, it's not Jiraiya who's the fragment package uh, I, I found out recently that apparently it does not transfer over to another week so if you actually do consume uh, make sure to get all of your Jiraiya fr uh, Tsunade fragments right now because if you don't, you may end up losing them when it changes to uh, the next uh, the next uh, legendary ninja. That being Orochimaru or Jiraiya. I'm not quite sure which one of the two it will be. But uh, when it does change, you may just lose all of that consumption process. Uh, but yeah, I'm kind of nervous of doing this because at the same time, uh, what if it's like the next event is a Sasuke event? And I just miss out on it because I wanted to get this for Jiraiya. It would really, really suck. Uh, but at the same time, I'm of the thought that, you know, there's other events. There will be more chances, basically. And besides, should it be something like a Hashirama event or a Togurama event, I actually do have the funds to spend for that and get all of the gold needed. So, I mean, it's not much of a difference. Uh, but yeah, it's Jiraiya. Um... I guess that was a showcase on Gold Jiraiya. Uh, no, I'm not really a showcase because I don't have all of his items. I don't have him at his full potential, basically. And it's a little frustrating, but I have to learn to deal with it, basically. But yeah, he he has the potential to be very, very powerful. Now, obviously, my Naruto is more powerful, but um, as of right now, I have I don't have um, uh, what's his face. Uh, Tobirama, so I mean, I have to make do with Jiraiya, I suppose. Um, honestly, this could really come back and bite me in the ass, like I said. Like, maybe very soon there'll be a Tobirama event, and I'm just caught with my pants down. Uh, but at the same time, like I said, uh, there will always be more events, and no need to get really, you know, um, huffy about it, I guess. For me, at the very least. Uh, but yeah. <sighs> So yeah, right now he's sitting pretty at 1.4 million. Uh, obviously, he'll go up when I get all of his items to tier 4. But it's going to take some time because, like I said, I need uh, I need a Will of Fire. And Will of Fire are not cheap, especially when it comes to Rare Ore. So, I mean, it may take a good 2 or 3 weeks. Um, just depending on like the next event and the reward for the recharge. Um, so yeah, I think that's about it for this video. Not much else to tell about it. Um, Jiraiya turns out to be a very good, uh, very good item. I mean, a very good card, especially with all of his items, at the very least with Fukusaku and Shima. Um, there's Death of Jiraiya. It just has some basic, basic drops. Uh, it has each Asia tactics, um, which gives you the Shinobi World War, uh, uh, Jiraiya, if you have, uh, basically 10, I mean, 50 of those, uh, 50 of the each each tactics, but more often than not, you're probably going to have to buy them instead of just, uh, getting them like that, because they are rather rare of a drop inside that dungeon. Uh, same thing with Conan's Flower of Hope, uh, it may, it's like 50 for the skin, but honestly, they're a very rare drop, so I wouldn't get my hopes up. Um... Yeah, I think that's about it. Uh, not going to cover anything else, really. I'm uh, just going to wait until I can get that secondary passive, and then I'm going to go ahead and showcase it, uh, you know, like Jiraiya with all his items um, and such. But I think that's about it for Jiraiya's items. I th as far as I know, that's all he gets. Uh, like He gets the Gata. He gets this thing, the Geta, um, the Lion's Mane, uh, the Oil Headband, the Fukusaku. And the map my boku, and I think that's about all he gets. Shoot, shoot, shoot. I'm so sorry I dropped the phone. I was look I looked towards my left and like it just shot. So I'm probably gonna put a noise a warning on this now. So uh yeah, like I said, I think that's about it for this video. Um leave a like if you liked it, leave a dislike if you don't. I appreciate you watching and I'll see you tomorrow. I'm more than likely also gonna get these right over here the 20k gold consumption because i do need the gut get a refining material so 20k gold consumption i can do it right now but i'm not planning on spending any more than 20k so um it'll just be easier if i don't if i don't do that you know if i do do that you know just spent just wait until like the last two days which is to a day and well tomorrow and the day after tomorrow 
Because it's only a three-day event, so I mean, you know. And another thing, as far as um secondary passives, Jiraiya is rather cheap. Because he is only um 500 gold each day, so 500 times 3, how much is that? Um, that's 1,500 gold, 1,500 gold, it's like, what, $15, uh, 15 times 3, well, yeah, 15 times 3, that's, what, 45, add in $3 for, like, the 99 cents, uh, $3, and, yeah, $48 in total for Dryas passive, where there's other passives that cost a lot more. Um, so yeah, I dare say that's about it for this video, so please leave a like if you liked it, leave a dislike if you don't. I appreciate you watching, and I'll see you tomorrow with a new video. Bye.